Typically, Mother's Day is when apple orchards across the area start to see their crops in full bloom. At Kircher Sunrise Orchards, though, they're already a month ahead of schedule with their apple blooms. If you look closely at the tree branches at this Elkhart County Orchard, there are a lot of things happening already, weeks ahead of when it should. We've got some buds that are definitely moving. They're swelling up and they're starting to open up. You can see the green leaves coming out. This is the green tip stage of apple blossoms. Orchard owner Maureen Kircher says at this point, the buds could take temperatures down to 16 degrees. Anything colder than that spells trouble. January already brought trouble to Kircher's. We lost the peach crop in January. Peach, peach trees are spring hardy. They can stand colder temperatures in the spring where apples are winter hardy. Cold weather is not totally a bad thing for the apples. At the stage these buds are in now, cooler temperatures will keep things from progressing too fast. As the buds grow and get closer to blossoming, the threshold temperature goes up. This is a good week. This will hold things off another week for us. Kirchers took advantage of the warmer temperatures the last few weeks and are experimenting with an early planting of sweet corn by keeping the surrounding temperature more than 10 degrees warmer with a covering of plastic. The seeds are germinating, so we'll just see. You know, sometimes you can, you can push that corn into an early market where the prices are better. But until the threat of cold weather goes away, it's all eyes on the temperatures for the apple blossoms. Owners here at Kircher's know that April is going to be a long month, so through that time, they're going to keep a close and constant eye on their crops. Reporting in Elkhart County, I'm meteorologist Lynette Grant, WSBT 22 News. I'm John Paul. Thanks for watching. Here's another video for you to watch. Also, please take a moment to subscribe to our channel.